Hey guys, what's up Taurus? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can be reversed. So flip it how you need to. Also remember it's a general reading. So just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. And if you'd like to contact me for our personal reading, that is below as well. It's kind of coming across like there's an energy that's like um, protective of their heart, their selves. Could be done with another earth sign, water signs there. All right, media future, what's coming up for Taurus, please? Thank you. You got the... Oh, shoot. All right, we'll take these. The Fool, the Two of Pentacles, and the Two of Wands. Interesting. This is all about taking a chance, um, taking action towards something. So it kind of feels like there's this contemplation energy in the middle with the Two of Pentacles, but then you're ending with the Two of Wands. So it does look like there's action. So when we're starting with the Fool, that's about um, being optimistic, taking a chance, taking action, even if it's a leap of faith. So for the obstacle, this can be a couple of things and we're going to clarify it, but this can be kind of on the fence about something, like I said, like an indecisive energy as a person or a relationship. It can be somebody who's kind of like one foot in, one foot out, but it does look like something is about to begin moving forward. So show me the fool for Taurus, please. Pretty straightforward energy. All right, so with the Fool, you got the Knight of Cups. Again, you could be dealing with a water sign. Tell me about this Knight of Cups. This is like somebody taking a chance on love. But when it came to that, somebody pulled back. This can be a situation where it's like, you know, you could have walked away. But it feels more of like a temporary pause, like there has been some pain. Actually, this could have ended. There could be some emotional or physical distances there, but it's something that's trying to like start back up. It's still there in your energy. So over here, we kind of have an energy that at the very least has pulled back emotionally. But with the Ten of Swords and the world, it's possible. Let me move these over. That this situation, this chapter did close or is closing. So that's the situation. So for the obstacle, we got this two of pentacles. This is somebody who's still on the fence. So it's like a situation that ended. Somebody could have options here. Hasn't been a whole lot of movement yet. But this, while this, this chapter closed, um, it's still in your energy. So the hangman came out. You could be dealing with a Pisces. But it's more so like about moving forward and moving on past something here. And there is, oh, this shit is done. Um, sorry, not for all, but you have the death card there. So it's almost coming across like a situation, a chapter that has closed. But on one side, it's still like somebody's caught in that energy, still holding on here. For some, there could be like kind of figuring out where to head next, life in general, about moving forward. But when we got a chapter with the death and the ten of swords, that's a pretty solid ending. Could be done with the Scorpio, but, um, all right, show me the, uh, two of wands, but it's still in your energy before I cut myself off. Show me the outcome for Taurus, please. This is progress with the two of wands. You could have some choices overall here. These feelings are still here. Whoever this situation was where the chapter is closing, the ending is there. Um, tell me more about this Two of Wands for the outcome for Taurus, please. You got the Two of Wands, the Three of Wands. Outcome for Taurus, please. Sorry about that. It does look like you're moving on, but there's still like this waiting energy. It's kind of happening like one day at a time, slow but steady progress. But um, 
it's kind of like emphasis on this that still ended is in your energy but also or is kind of connected still to your energy or to you however sometimes with the uh even if you're even if this isn't like related to a person another person right it, this can be like a chapter closing but when it comes to like kind of moving on or taking the next steps necessary you know procrastination can kind of be there you got the chariot that came out, Cancer Energy. So it does look like things are moving forward in general, um, getting on the right track and beginning to progress. You're kind of just taking it one day at a time. And we're kind of getting to that energy of like, if you think about a scale of like one to 10, the... Um, things are kind of at a three, but you got the Queen of Wands so it does, and the Six of Wands. You're going to be just fine, whether it's love or work, whatever it is. You got the Six of Wands and the Queen of Wands. Could be seen in the public eye. There could be raises, promotions. But in general, this is a really feel-good, happy, confident, having options, looking good, and progression type energy. So procrastination or kind of moving on may have been the obstacle or waiting to figure things out. Um, somebody's still definitely holding on, but you're moving on. You're manifesting. All right, Taurus, I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you'd like to contact me for our personal reading, that is below as well. You guys take care and I will see you next time.